Okay, there are 130 adults in language school. Each one studies French, German or Spanish and we're told the following. The best way to solve these ones is really a two-way table. So I'm going to draw out a two-way table as follows. And what do we have? So we have the following. We've got, um, along the top, we've got the, the language they study. So they either study French, Spanish or German and we have a total, and they are men or women, so men or women, and they have a total. Okay, so once you've drawn yourself a grid like this, just draw yourself some lines. It makes everything so much easier when you're working out in a question like this. So uh, it's not a two, uh, we've got a two-way table going on here, and let's fill everything in. So let's fill in the information from the question. 96 adults are women, so we've got um, 96 are women in total. We've got 130 adults, so 130 adults in total. 12 women study French, so 12 women study French. 73 adults study Spanish, so the total of Spanish is 73. 55 women study Spanish, 55 women study Spanish, and 9 men study German, so 9 men study German. The question is, how many adults study French? we are trying to find the total of this column here. And the best way to do it is fill in all the blanks that we possibly can. So, how many men in total? So it would be 130 subtract 96. So 130 subtract 96 is gonna be 34. So we put in 34 in here. How many women study German? So what we would do is we'd have 96, subtract the 12, subtract the 55, would be equal to 29 as follows. Okay, how many in German in total? Well, it would be 9, add the 29, is going to be equal to 38. How many women, how many in total study French, therefore? Well, what we could do is we know it's 130, subtract the 73 here, subtract the 38 here, would be equal to 19. So our answer there is going to be equal to 19. The total number of adults that study French.